Hi everyone, this is Tammy, owner of Worthy Worth It and Priceless. And today's podcast is titled, It's Okay to Rest. Um, if you follow me on any social media other than or like basically Facebook, everything is under Worthy Worth It and Priceless. But for the last few days, I actually wasn't on social media. And I really haven't um, been posting anything onto the Facebook pages and I really haven't been doing um, any pillows, any products, or anything for the store. And even if you go on to the Worthy Worth and Priceless store, it's basically only the Worthy Worth and Priceless t-shirts and some of the Pring Women pillows, and that's basically it. Um, before that, I had like a whole bunch of products and different categories. I even had like home decor stuff. It was It was a lot of stuff that was on there. And what I realized was that I believe for myself, I was overdoing it. And I was overdoing it so much that I was even confusing myself. And even to the point that I believe that I wasn't really doing the call that was on my life. And I was basically making my own call, which I don't uh, advise anyone to do. But when I realized that it was a little bit too much, I realized that I really had to sit back and actually rest and and basically spend time with God and on the journey of rediscovering myself and what God wanted me to do and everything. So with that being said, there will probably be changes, but as far as, you know, products or whatever, that'll be for another time. But for the most part, um, I realized just for myself, it was time to somewhat take a break. And we live in a place of the world really right now where social media and everything is just, or your phone, like the whole world is basically at your fingertips. If you need to look at something, if you want it to travel or anything, like, because now they have virtual realities where you can just, you know, basically look on your phone or have your phone attached to something. And for the most part, you could be out of here. You can, you know, what I mean, you could just travel all the worlds or whatever and, you know, stuff like that. But in certain situations, it comes to the point of being overwhelming. And when that happens, you have to take a break. Also, within that time, I know it was like the last week of, um, we're in, in June, sorry. My daughter got sick and it was like my daughter was seen, it seemed like she was being under attack health wise. It was really bad. She, um, ended up getting, uh, ingrown toenail so that took like a week for for uh, the antibiotics for that then right after that she ended up waking up one morning she had a bloody nose and I believe that that was like from the fans then she got out of school like on the 25th she ended up having a cold okay logical whatever the next day I took her to the park she ended up throwing up at the park then the next day, we went to, um, she had a physical for school. They discovered that she had an uh, ear infection. The next day, which was, it was the 27th, she ended up getting um, bit overnight by something. And her eye swelled up. They told me to give her Benadryl, this, that, and the third, put ice on it. That didn't work. The next day, the bottom part of her eye was swollen. We had to go back to the hospital. And so it was a lot. And a lot of times with that, it's God telling us to calm down and rest and and do things like that. And I know we live in a world where everything just has to get done. Everything has to be done at an urgent pace. Everything needs to be done immediately. And sometimes... 
we don't know how to rest. And God will actually basically put us on our behind where at the whole point it's like, hey, you're going to get, I'm going to get your attention one way or the other. You want to sit up here and act like you're not going to listen to me. You're not going to do this. Then all this stuff is going to happen where you will have to rest. And I even noticed like even for myself, it seemed like it was hard for me to like even lift my legs, you know, like you're getting out of bed or whatever. Cause I even like my day job, my actual job, it's a, it requires a lot of walking and it's walking on concrete floors. And so it was like, I could just feel my body breaking down. So what I would tell anyone, pay attention to your health, make sure you're drinking water, make sure you're getting the vegetables and everything that you have to do, but make sure that you also get the rest that you're supposed to get you will not be any help to anyone else if you're not getting the proper rest and the nutrients that you need for yourself and a lot of times we just feel like everything is just an urgent matter and everything has to be done immediately and at that moment but like I said you're not going to be any help to anyone else if you're not even of help to yourself if you're not here for your kids if you're not here for the the person that's in your life or you're not here for you know whoever else depends on you then what good would that be no matter what you have to make sure that you take care of yourself first even on planes they tell you to secure your mask first before you try to secure someone else's so it's okay to take a break it's okay to um basically rest nothing anything that is supposed to come to you is going to come to you regardless but make sure that you take care of yourself first you only have one life to live we don't know what's after this but the most important thing right now is just to make sure that basically you take care of yourself so i just want to give you that encouragement and just so you know no matter what god sees you as worthy worth it and priceless and until next time Bye.